It's the weekend here at Muscle in the Morning, brought to you by Iron Mag Labs. Make your mark. I'm Dave Palumbo, and today is Friday, June 9th, 2017. Let's find out what's going on in the world of bodybuilding and fitness. Keeping tabs on the IFBB's figure division reality show has been one of the not-so-secret pleasures so far this season. And next weekend in Dallas, things are about to get a whole lot more interesting when 2016 USA champ Tanya Wheatfall finally hits the stage to make our highly anticipated pro debut. This week, Muscle in the Morning was able to get our hands on some exclusive behind-the-scenes photos of Wheatfall, who looks like she's ready to step in and be a serious factor from the opening tip-off. Right now, we've got a major logjam of talent sitting at the top of the figure division. But if Wheatfall can stay consistent and make the right improvements when it counts, I think she has a shot to be someone we see challenging for a major title a few years down the line. For anyone out there who doesn't believe that aliens have ever visited Earth, may I present to you Exhibit A, a gentleman who likes to go by the name of Max Charles. This week, new training footage surfaced of Mad Max, looking about as otherworldly as you can get during a late night shoulder session at the mothership at Bev Francis Powerhouse Gym. Since putting together these two bookend performances at the Arnold and Arnold Australia to start the season, Max has managed to stay relatively quiet. But with the Olympia now officially less than 100 days away, I get the feeling that things in the Charles camp are about to get turned up a whole lot more. At this point, I think it's pretty well established that Bader Badai and the Camel crew are working some sort of voodoo magic out there at Oxygen Gym. And now it looks like 212 standout Ahmad Ahmad finally secured himself an invite to the party. Recently, some new video leaked out of somewhere inside of Team Oxygen that showed the former 212 Olympian absolutely crushing an arm training session and looking pretty damn good in the process. To his credit, when he's been able to stay injury free, Ahmad Ahmad has always been one of the more consistent guys you're ever going to find in the 212 division. And if he can put together a good run and suck up a little bit of that camel crew magic, this is a guy who's definitely capable of putting together a top 10 Olympia caliber look. Don't ask me why, but I've always liked the whole John Henry Mann versus Machine story since I was a kid. And you'd be hard pressed to find a guy who brings more of that old school, I'll work until I die sort of attitude with him to the gym day in and day out than 212 legend David Henry. After putting together what might have arguably been his best look of the last five years back at the Arnold Classic, the OG giant killer has been hard at work grinding away in his quest to drop the hammer one more time on the Olympia stage. For my money, Henry is probably one of the more underrated superstars of his entire generation. And if he can reach deep down in the tank one more time and give Flex Lewis the ultimate run for his money, I think it'll add a whole new chapter to his already historic legacy.